we are under the CMI trailer right now. This is step deck and this is the air tank and the ABS model with the brake valve. Here goes two in one, you can separate them on some of them. The ABS model goes separately. Here it goes together with a brake valve. And we have a problem, the ABS is not working and the light, ABS light is always on. I just inspected, started to inspect the, the sensor, inspect the sensor. And all the sensors show resistance 1253 ohms. But the resistance is good, but it should play like up and down while you spinning the tire. Now I'm gonna show you how it works. And what the problem is in our case. You can see the multimeter is connected. When you spinning the tire, it should go up and down. In our case, it's staying the same. And with time, you will get a lot of dirt inside. Here the seal was leaking and it had a lot of grease on it. And when the dirt is coming inside, it's pushing the sensors. As you can see, this sensor right now is too far. I already cleaned the ABS wheel and the sensor is too far from the wheel. So right now I'm gonna press it back in its place against the wheel. As you can see right now, is very very close to the ABS wheel. Now I'm gonna spin it and look at the multimeter. As you can see, the resistance is playing. It means the ABS sensor is working right now. So now I'm gonna check for the continuity and it have a sound like this here. So now I'm gonna spin it, you will hear it. It means that our ABS sensor right now is properly working. So now I'm gonna clean all of them because when they have dirt inside, the sensor is pushed away. The distance is, the gap is too too big and the sensor is not working. You can test it while you still have the tire on it. You can spin it, the tire and you can just connect a multimeter on the sensor that is con the connector of the sensor that is connected to the ABS model and just spin the tire and you will see if it's good or bad. If you have resistance it means it's good but still doesn't mean that it's working. If you have sound like this when you're spinning it, it means it's good and it's working. And that's it. If the sensor is bad you will not have resistance at all or it's gonna be too low. Also, as you can see, some sensors have extensions. Some of them are going like with, with a long wire directly to the ABS model, but some of them have a lot of extension cords like this. Like in our case, it have like two of them. So you should also insp you can remove if the sensor shows zero re resistance. You can just disconnect the first connector that goes that is coming like directly from the sensor and check the resistance right here because sometimes the problem can be in the extension wire. Right now the wheel is back, I'm gonna check one more time for continuity and I will hear the sound. This means that our ABS sensor is working. I'm gonna stop the wheel. You will not hear, hear this sound anymore. That's it.